Okay, hello everyone and welcome back. We are still in the dark, literally and figuratively. Oh crap. Run away from it, run away from it, run away from it. Don't try to fight it. Okay, um, okay come along this way. Yeah. And... Okay, we're just running along the side here and... See if we can find a... A place to duck down. Preferably one without a creeper in. Ooh, chickens! Do we smell that creeper behind us? Ooh, I feather. Don't. don't know how fast they are. Tend to not to be. Alright, now I've got some feathers out of those. Good. I've got five. Excellent. Keep hold of those. Alright, okay. So let's just find ourselves a... In fact, what the hell, I might as well just dig down. Right. It's getting late now. Uh. How long have you been with Team Tuxedo in address? Um, I'm not entirely sure, to be completely honest. Probably a couple of years, I think. Mm. Or maybe a year, I'm not sure. Oh, coal, excellent. That's good, I like coal. Yeah, let's just grab a couple of pieces of that and let's make ourselves some torches. Um, one thing you could do, Dress, which would be a great help, is to go up the top there and uh, seal the hole in with dirt so it doesn't look like anybody's dug down here. Thanks a lot. And I'll get us down. Hopefully we'll find a cave down here. And then we can start doing some proper exploring. Exploring is good. Exploring is good. Uh, I think I might have missed some coal there. So if you could grab that on the way down, that would be absolutely fantastic. Can I get coal with a wooden pick? You can get coal with a wooden pick. Cool. Dog... I don't know what you've done with it. It's your own stupid fault for putting it there. I can't see it. So you're not having it. Oh, but... I'm going to need to eat soon. Mm -hmm. Yeah, same here. Um, in fact, I'll tell you what. Let's hollow out this out a little bit. Let's make ourselves a little base here. this to get ourselves a crafting bench down okay, and make ourselves cut the furnaces okay. cook the food and cook the food absolutely so I've got some chicken there and a couple of those should do that. There we go. I've got a load of raw mutton. No, no, no. I'll chuck that in the other furnace. If you could put some coal under that, that would be really good. Aha, all the way down here. And while that's cooking up, let's carry on with the mining. Keep our ears open for a cave. Still coal up here. Excellent. That's good. Let's get my inventory organized a little bit there. I think this has got to be the most solid bit of Minecraft I've ever been through. <laughs> yeah, it's not even pretending to have a cave nearby. No. Right. 
And some iron. Excellent. Let's get I... that smelt as quickly as possible. Don't know if I can mine it with a wooden pick. No, you can't. You need to make yourself a stone one. Ah, oh, cool. That means I need to bash stone. Hold on a sec. I've got a load of it. You can come down to our little communal area and I'll give you some tools. Cool. I'll put my food in to cook. Okay. Make myself some sticks. Okay, so... Okay. Oh, thank you. And sword, pickaxe. Probably won't need it at this point, but max. Add the sword again. And I'll have the cooked chicken. That is very nice exchange. Thank you very much. No problem. I shall go and get some iron. Alright, brilliant. Um, shall I grab this coal? Yeah, I think we'll grab this coal. do me for now okay right digging down for the ex thought I heard water there for a second would that be bad no that would mean there's a uh, possibility of a cave Excellent. Let's have a little search around here, see if we can find them. Wow, I'm not on the lowest HP. Oh wow, what happened to Whip? Don't know. Both of them have lost quite a bit of HP. Yes. Want me to get this coal up here? Yeah, if you don't mind. Perhaps they stood too close to a blowy up creeper one. Yeah, it's possible, isn't it? How much iron did you find? Eight. Oh, that's marvellous. Alright, okay, I found us a... a cave. So let's start... tentatively uh, searching around here. We're still cooking food. Ah. Uh. Pull food out, put you in. Put the raw food in with itself. Let's just block that off for a minute. Yeah, this looks like a fairly nice cave to be honest with you. Number of pathways, I'm just going to block off some of them and we'll go and explore the other ones. Sounds good. I am cooking iron. Marvellous. Okay, when that's all cooked up, could you pick up all that stuff and bring it down here? Uh, yep. Thanks. Okay, how far down are we? Um. 20. Okay, so we're at the top of the diamond layer already. That's brilliant. So, uh, this should be a good place to find some resources. Cool. They're always good to have. They are. I've got a bone to pick with Squizzy from the last UHC we were in. <laughs> no. Oh, found iron. Oh, found gold. It's always good. I don't know whether to say this to you. Ooh, found lava. Oh yay. I need a bucket <laughs> first. 
I think that's that's the first thing I, I know knew about you. You started on Team Tuxedo and died fifty times the first day. Yeah, pretty much. I died quite a lot on the first day. You <clears throat> did. It was it was impressive. I'm um, seriously. I died within about five seconds of logging on. <laughs> Fell down some chasm in the dark, and I was like, "Ah, oh, where did that come from?" Died. I died already. That's not good. And then you decided to build a house out of lava. Yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, certainly but... impressive. <laughs> okay, that's enough of that for now. Let me get this iron. Makes it easy to locate. Yes. Okay, let's put our. Yay, iron. Did you want the iron? Just left us iron. Uh, how much you got? Eight. Yeah. Hmm. I think uh, make yourself an iron pick and let's leave the rest for now. Okay. Okay. What's benchmarking? Um, making a a workbench. Ah. Uh. It's a clever trick, man, to put that off for so long. <laughs> okay. Um, Are we likely to need wool for anything? No. Oh, stop carrying it around then. Yeah, I've used it to block up some passageways. <laughs> Cook some more chicken. First thing, uh, the first UHC I ever saw was um, Kurt J. Mack of, um, you know, Farmlands or Bust fame, and I don't think he quite got the rules at that time because uh, he was quite excited to get wool, and he made a bed and set his spawn. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit puzzled why nobody else would sleep. Uh, yeah. Because we're hunting. Yes. Okay. I'm going to make myself an iron pickaxe with what I found. And I'm going to go and grab myself that gold. Um. Sticks. Oh, hello. Hi. Is that the way we're exploring? Uh huh. Well, this is this is come. This actually comes to a dead end. So I think we're going to open up one of the other passageways in a sec. All right, another five gold, and we make golden apple. Cool. That'd be fun. All right, it's two passageways here. I suggest you just pick one. What in either direction? Yeah. Make a torch, that might be a good idea. Yep, tends to help. It does. Okay, that passage ran out quickly. Alright. Travel, actually. Let's go and see if I can make myself some. That'd be good. I've got one already. Excellent. I'm quite happy. I can make my fun Nintendo. <laughs> <laughs> if nothing else, except set people on fire. <laughs> Absolutely. I knew that would appeal to you. Blue stuff. I know we need that. Absolutely. Right. Dark blue? Well, I don't know. Maybe blue. Oh, yeah. It says lapis or all right. on that F3 thing, which I have on all the time, so mm -hmm. that I can tell stuff apart, because my eyes are broken. <laughs> well, you've seen me. Without my glasses, I walk into small and consequential things like walls. Yeah. I know, I know the feeling. It's annoying. Yes. That's why I went for blue. <laughs> I'm not going to have any problems differentiating you with anybody else. <laughs> Fair enough. 
There's no danger of me accidentally killing the wrong person. Hopefully. <laughs> Uh, always part of the fun of the UHC. Being slaughtered by your team members. Oh, you flint. Those two have taken another beating. Good lord, yes, I think... They probably just fed up with the inefficiency of us men who've decided to do, uh, do, do the job for us. <laughs> right. That's enough of that. I don't think I need five of them. Oh, right, okay. That wasn't much one, but I'm hearing a bat in this direction, so let's dig a little bit further. There's one flying around in here. I hope it, well, that wasn't the one I heard then. Could have been. It's very close to me, and you're not that far away. Yeah. We haven't quite found enough iron yet. Twenty-three lapisy stuffs. That's good. That'll sort. That that that'll do us for enchanting. Cool. Oh, more gold. Oh, good. Ten gold. Excellent. So we can now make a golden apple. Cool. Come on, Mr. Batch, where are you? I bet you heard that one that was up there. No, I'm hearing it now and I'm quite a way away from you. Oh, I'm hearing lava as well. Glad you can hear the sounds off the game. You can hear the bashing rock noise, but that's about it. <laughs> The heightened senses of the UHC. -er. Thank you very much. There we go. Lava. I'm hearing water off this way, so let's follow this down a bit. I'm going to find it really hard not to play with the lava. <laughs> We're going to want that for an enchanting table. Hopefully. Though we still haven't got leather. Do we need that for an enchanting table? Yep. Yeah. Uh oh. We need to make a book. Eek. Right, there we go. Alright. Lock that up. There we go. Alright. Looks like the water's above us. Slightly nervous about this because I can hear lava in the same direction as well. Alright, that's the end of the episode. Thank you very much guys. We shall see you all in a couple of days time.